to them and nothing was ever given to me. I either worked for it or stole it. Are you upstairs working on things, or are you downstairs tearing things up? Downstairs. Cutting the bottom out. And random windows are falling off. One of Robert Knievel's first motorcycle crashes was during a police chase. And while he sat in prison for reckless driving, it was a joke made by one of the police officers that gave him the nickname, Evil Knievel. Evil Knievel wasn't a bad kid. Evil Knievel was a typical dude kid who wanted to do something better than working mind for but He always wanted to do something different. He, uh, came up with a, a game. Is it going something other than sort of pissed that I'm doing this? <laughs> I hear something, but I don't see anything. That's right here, where, about where I'm at. It does not like what I'm doing. Um, wow. I'm what? thinking getting hit by some of that would suck. Yes, there are panes of broken glass falling from the sky. Well, I'm starting to get around to the front, so it shouldn't be long. This is hysterical. The glass starts falling off the outside as you saw the bottom out. Sure, you don't want to put a fuel t can in there to hold it up. I'm good. Uh oh. What? This whole side just fell off. <laughs> I'm trying to record this. And we are here at the Omni Nightclub at Caesar's Palace, right next door to the Incredible Fountain Jump. That will be the third jump of South Strata. We are joined again by Bob Sorkonich. Got a record for You were looking at me like, Matthew Keller, please don't do me. Yeah. Don't do me like that. Uh, Deputy Online Editor of Broken Fat Magazine. Hold on just a second. Now they can up. What's wrong? Uh, I want to see if any of the things that fell were loot containers. They were not. I'm severing the uh, um, awning. That would be hysterical if that was all that was holding it up. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> if you could have just walked up and cut the awning and dropped the whole thing. Uh oh. There it goes. You can tell that to a car. Travis has done a lot of jumps in cars where you have a roll cage. Uh things are falling behind you. It's it's a completely different animal. I mean body is on the line here. But then did you put down a uh a uh sleeping bag just in case you die? It's a friggin' long walk from here. To our sleeping bags. So oh, that's what we go to the bikes thing, really. Double the uh he was forty eight when he jumped Caesar when Evil jumped Caesar's and uh gas on me. Biggest bike. And about eight leathers, hundred and fifty and Travis is about it. The doctors uh have just been told have cleared Travis, body temperature is good and he is ready to go on the second jump. Of course, it's looking a little ragged, ain't it? That when yeah. people tried to jump uh the sixteen buses in London. It did not go very well. The first time that he jumped over. Thinking going up in that now would be a very bad plan. Eight years after the Caesar filming jump, 
evil with temptation once again, jumping 13 buses at London's famous Wembley Stadium. It was like a come. I just fired a crossbow bolt up and broke a piece of glass. He attracted 70,000 fans that day, and was even more watching on live TV in the States. While evil knew the chance that he'd land a stunt or slam, he wouldn't have a chance. Oh, here it goes. It's going. Uh, the whole thing's coming down, it looks like. Oh, nope, just the top. The back and top fell. One more block. Uh, it's starting to come down and... Uh-oh. That there it goes. Sitting at the top of a takeoff ramp, in the back of his mind, knowing this is not going to go well, but yet he gave his word that he was going to do it. The stuff got about halfway down and then stopped. Well, some of it may fill in the missing parts. You know what I mean? Yeah. Nope, it's going. It's toast. <laughs> His crash was so violent, he tumbled and slid for 50 feet with a 320 plus pound bike ending up on top of him. No, the main tower stayed up because it did indeed fill in missing parts. Yeah. Alright, let me get some of this. They need to let us make parachutes so we could jump off of buildings and pop a parachute. All right, how's it doing? It's coming down pretty good. Uh, nope, it stopped again. Oop, there it goes. There's a horde of zombies. Where? Oh! Behind the building. There's soldiers behind the bikers? Oh no, those are workers. What's that? I thought those were soldiers, they were workers. I need these servers and bikers, I should have got them in. Yeah, I need to put my coat back on. I am freezing. Did you put your uh, poncho on? Yes, yeah, I just took my Travis coat off. Pastrana, as he's gone one down in his quest for three of Evil Canadian's most iconic jumps, uh, as you can see, golf claps all around. Yeah, I was down to, to 13. <laughs> I guess you could say we knew uh, that he was going to have it in the bag. You guys have families. Um, you, you both, you know, over the course of your, your career, decided to do two things that your family have to ride it out with in case things don't go well. What is it like for your family? Well, I mean, uh, you know, I, the hell is holding it up? The flowers? Ah, uh, there it is. Oh no! There's a there's a block right there. I just saw an already zombie up there. Well, yeah, that was that was a big one. It's 
So, can we shoot the irradiated zombie out of the air? <laughs> <laughs> Skeet. Wow. That looks like a wicked wizard's tower kind of thing now, you know? Look at the lights just kind of hold... Oh, they were hanging there lit. <laughs> you kidding me? Ah, I'm in there. The hell is holding it up? It looks like the flowers are holding the damn thing up. Oh, it's this light. Hold on. This light right here is holding the whole thing up. <laughs> or not. The hell? Mm, it's levitating. Unless the, there's a rock in here holding it up. Alright, if you, you get this level out and it doesn't fall, we're gonna build a base in this thing. <laughs> <laughs> the wizard star. Now, do you see how the blocks are falling as soon as I break them out of the one type of concrete? Yeah. Seriously, because if, if the whole thing will levitate like that for the rest of its life, we can't, we can never be touched again. Well, what disturbs me is every time I break it from reinforced onto regular, it just falls. Except on a seven day, if a cop came along and puked and broke the one thing holding it all up. Yeah, I can't see what could be holding this. I mean, there's nothing here. Can you attach blocks to it? No, it's like the floating pit. Oop, there goes something. You got it? Yeah, well, I've had a lot of experience collapsing pits that float. Oh, you have wow. To connect it to the ground. Can you grab that? Well, that was fun. The whole floating tower thing is awesome, though. Yes. I, I'm going to call this a. Uh, good stopping point for the night. See if I can crash myself the next time I log in looking at that. <laughs> yeah, the passing gas uh, repair shop kind of
Yeah, I'm gonna head on home.